Thank you for using Market Writers as your online portfolio manager. This is a very quick video that will show you how to use the online portfolio manager. You will invest your money using asset allocation, which allows you to put your money in various asset classes globally. You'll be protecting your money from fees because we will be recommending to you very, very low cost exchange traded funds or ETFs. Our strategies are modeled after how wealthy families and endowments and foundations invest, and their strategies have been modeled from the work of Nobel laureates and very, very sophisticated investment professionals. Our software will be watching your money all the time so that you can do what you do best. You won't have to worry about market shifts because when there's a need for you to do something, we will be sending you an email alert to do so. Also, the advice that you are receiving from us is unbiased. We do not receive any commissions from the ETFs we recommend. We are beholden to no one but you. So, let's get started and get going on your first Market Writers portfolio. When you log into your Market Writers account for the very first time, you will see a screen that looks like this. It says, it's your first portfolio. You have no portfolios, let's start a new one. You click OK. There are two options. One is build it for me, the other is let me build it. This video only focuses on build it for me. You can look in our tutorial library and look for another video if you'd like to build a more customized ETF portfolio where you choose the ETFs. If you would like us to recommend ETFs, you click build it for me and you will be asked several questions. First of all, tell us how old you are. Second of all, Tell us when you're going to start needing these funds for retirement or other purposes. In this case, let's assume someone is 40 years old and they don't need this money for at least 10 years. How much investment experience do you have? If you put good or limited, you can also learn what we mean by the term investment experience by clicking on info. And then how much risk can you handle? In this case, I'm going to invest $100,000 in this portfolio and then you click suggest a portfolio and this is the asset allocation market writers is recommending for this individual. In this case bonds are a 24% allocation, foreign developed stocks a 14.5% allocation and you can read about the growth focus 30% bond 14 ETF portfolio by looking through this scroll bar. You can also click on this link, how did we determine these percentages and understand better how we came up with this allocation for you. And also you can look at how this portfolio has performed over the last 12 months relative to other well-known indices. When you click continue, you move to step two. In step two, you see the actual ETFs we're recommending that you purchase in order to execute on the asset allocation recommended in step one. For example, in step one, we recommended a 7% allocation to emerging market stocks. Emerging market stocks are all of the stocks in 30 or so emerging market economies like Russia, India, China, Brazil, India. And we are also recommending that you buy 168 shares of VWO. VWO is a Vanguard ETF that includes 840 common stocks in emerging market economies. And we show you the percent of expenses in this ETF and some of the holdings. You can also look exactly at what you're looking at by clicking on what am I looking at and understand more about ETFs. We also show you how much you're saving with this ETF portfolio. So for a $100,000 ETF portfolio, the fees in all of these ETFs total $193.61, or 0.19% of the whole value. And we compare what that would cost if it was a similar portfolio of mutual funds, where it would be at least $1,500 and perhaps a lot more. And we show how much that can compound over time. When you've had a chance to look through the portfolio, click on all of the various ETFs and understand exactly what we're recommending, it's now time to give your portfolio a name. So I'm going to name this my IRA in my Roth account. I happen to use Schwab for all of my accounts, so I'm going to click on Schwab. And now I'm going to click Continue, 
and go to the final step number three. It's now time to review our recommendations and purchase this portfolio at your online broker. You just created your first market writer's portfolio and so now you need to review the purchase recommendations, buy it at your online broker, tell us what you paid for the ETF shares and then let us track it for you. In this case, all the recommendations in step two are listed here as a group. You can actually push this printer button and get a copy of it on your printer. We're also emailing you a copy so you'll get a copy of it on your email account. And so now it's time to click onto your Schwab account and we've provided a link here and go log on and purchase the ETF shares. In this case, this is the window in my Schwab account and so I'm being instructed to buy 192 shares of VWO. I'd input VWO in the 192 shares. I'd review the order and I would click purchase. I'd go through this entire list and do that so that all of the ETF shares that are recommended would be purchased which would give me an exact asset allocation according to recommendations. Of course anytime you're stuck you can click the help link which is in any of these screens and once I've made these purchases I click finish. This portfolio will now appear on my dashboard. The dashboard is where all of your market writers portfolios will live on our site and you can easily get there by clicking on my portfolio. We've just bought Mitch's Roth IRA in my Schwab account and now it's time to confirm what we paid for everything at Schwab. So I click confirm purchases and I go through my trade receipts at Schwab and I input the exact amount that I paid for ETF share. So in this case, let's say that I bought Bill, B-I-L, for $45.45 and let's say VWO I paid $41.22. I would go through each ETF and I would give market writers the exact amount that I had paid per share and then simply click save my portfolio. Now the portfolio will be tracked in market writers and at any time you can click view activity and see how the portfolio is doing. You can also look at the allocation percentages and see how they're drifting from the targets. At certain points we will be sending you rebalancing instructions and this is a place you can come back to and see exactly how different the actuals are from the targets. And you can actually do some analytics in the returns tab as soon as the portfolio begins to start maturing. And that's it. That's all there is to it. You can now sit back, relax, do what you do best, let us do what we do best, and continue watching this portfolio for you. Thank you again for letting Market Riders be your online portfolio manager. We don't think you'll be disappointed. If you have any questions, you can always give us a call at 1-866-990-ETFS, and we wish you great success with your investing. Thanks again.